Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Well, here we are on hump day. The 8th of December, 2021. Time's moving on, guys. Well, I've got something little prolific, something of importance to say, something that's been stewing in my mind, and I don't reckon I'm the first to have ever come up with it, but uh, whenever we think of something and, you know, we need to get it out. We need to share it with people sometimes. Uh, let me break it down real quick in just kind of a simple way. Please forgive that sound. That's our air unit popping on and off. So, um, the fight, the fight that we go through with diet, exercise, and this lifestyle is uh, a tricky thing. And that really goes for anything in life. And uh, one thing that I've learned recently is until you stop listening to your head, uh, you're going to continue having fallbacks, starts and stops, uh, downfalls. Your brain can lead you in the most horrible direction. When you go into your local supermarket, your brain sees the first thing as you're going in the door. It's always cookies, cakes, chocolates, all kind of stuff as you're walking in the door. Your brain wants you to go and get those. Your passion in your heart has to overcome, has to overrun your brain. In a blink of an eye, guys, it has to overcome that thought. When you're walking down the aisle and you see your pizzas and you're walking down the aisle and you see your sodas and your, and your chips and all the other junk food that's presented to you and shoved in your face uh, your mind wants to grab it you have to keep walking you have to get past it the only way to get past this is with your desire your heart your passions your goals your dreams and that's the only way you're going to get past your weak mind. We have weak minds. Regardless of how amazing our minds are, we have very weak minds. And until we can finally overcome and beat our stupid, <laughs> smart minds, we're going to struggle every day. And that's whether it's fitness related or job related or relationship related or any kind of relation, uh, any sort of thing that we're trying to do in our lives. Uh, it, it's one of the biggest hurdles that we're going to overcome is our own self. And that's something that I'm, I'm learning and that I've learned a lot over the past few months. And uh, yeah, uh, you've got to shut the mind down and you have to let your passion and your desire and your goals uh, win uh, every day and that's from getting up to getting dressed all the way to putting your night clothes on and laying down your whole day has to be about you winning the battle over your mind so there's nothing more that I would rather do than to sit in this chair or my recliner or something and have a bag of hot chips a Sprite, a Twix candy bar, a pack of Oreos with a cup of milk, and a big pop of dill pickle to follow it all up at the end. There's nothing more I'd rather have, guys. But the second that I give in to any of those desires is the second that I've set myself up for failure. Uh, this way of this lifestyle that we choose to follow and that we all should follow it's a drug um, all these things that we're shoving in our face uh, at the stores and that all these companies are shoving in our faces they're a drug they're no different than crack and cocaine and pot and liquor and everything else pills it's a drug and they're trying to keep us hooked so we continue to struggle 
so we continue to need medications, so we continue to uh, have all these health issues and go to doctors and have all these other problems and, uh, you know, they don't care. They don't care about us. They care about the money and that's it. Um, getting a little bit off track, but staying kind of on track here. Um, yeah. So anyway, guys, if you want to win this battle and live the lifestyle that you're supposed to be living, which is not overweight, not unhealthy... Uh, it takes a strong passion and desire to flip the switch in that mind because the mind is a powerful tool. And I think a lot of people uh, like to think that the mind is in control of everything when actually it's your heart, it's your desire and your passions and uh, what goals are worth fighting for. That's what's most important and that is what's going to end up overtaking the bad in your mind so have it here and you'll have it here so have it here and you'll have it here anyway guys this is the body beat down happy hump day like share subscribe comment all that good stuff I hope you find something useful on my channel and while you're at it, take a look at these shirts, guys. These shirts explain everything that I try to do in my daily life. And that is to get up, get out, get ready, do it to it. Here on the Body Beatdown with me, Michael. Have a great day. Inspire someone today. Most importantly, inspire yourself. All right? Get up, get out, get ready, do it to it. And we'll see you all later. Get up, get out, get ready, do it to